welcome to aminacademy.com in analytical solid geometry let us discuss about mutually perpendicular generators of a cone to find the condition that the cone ax square plus by square plus cz square plus 2fyz plus 2gzx plus 2hxy equals 0 should have three mutually perpendicular generators now we will prove what is the condition for the mutually perpendicular cone mutually perpendicular generators for this cone let it be this equation is 1 let x over alpha equal y over beta and z over gamma be any generators of a cone so that a that means we are uh, let it be this equal to 1 then we can get it x equal to alpha y equal to beta and z equal to gamma then substitute the value of x and y and z here that is a alpha square instead of x square we are using alpha square plus b beta square plus c gamma square plus 2 f beta gamma plus 2 g gamma alpha plus 2 h alpha beta equal to 0 let it be this equation 3 now the equation of the plan through the origin perpendicular to the plan to here this is a line 2 we have to find the equation of the plan passing through origin and perpendicular to this line is alpha x plus beta y plus gamma z that means we are substituting this alpha beta gamma equals 0 let it be equation 4 if L, M and N be the direction cosines of any of the generators in which the plan cuts the given cone that is given cone is here that means we are if alpha uh, L, M and N be the direction cosines of any generators in which the plan cuts the given cone is A L square plus B M square plus C N square plus 2 F M N plus 2GNL plus 2HLM that is we are substituting L, M and N let it be this is Y and with L alpha plus M beta plus N gamma equal to 0 these two equations gives the condition generator in which the plan cuts the given cone now we have to eliminate n between 5 and 6 here get the value of uh, get the value of n that is n alpha equal to minus l alpha minus m beta over gamma then we have to substitute that n value to this equation 5 we have l square into a gamma square plus c alpha square minus 2g alpha gamma plus 2lm into c alpha beta plus h gamma square minus g beta gamma plus f alpha gamma plus m square into b gamma square plus c beta square minus 2f beta gamma equal to 0 that means we are getting the value of n from this and substitute this equation then simplify we will get this way this in which is a quadratic in terms of l ratio m this is a quadratic equation in terms of l and l ratio m we see that the plan 4 look at this here this plan 4 cuts the given code in two generators because we are uh, having the two solutions here two generators then we have the ratio of l1 l2 over m1 m2 equal that beta gamma square plus c alpha square minus 2 f alpha gamma over a gamma square plus c alpha square minus 2 g alpha gamma that means we are getting these ratios from this expression or by cross multiplying this means l1 l2 over this from here beta gamma square 
is C alpha square minus 2F alpha gamma, which is equal to this M1 M2 go this side, M1 M2 over A gamma square plus C alpha square minus 2G alpha gamma. We have ratios like. By symmetry, we can find N1 N2 also. Yeah. N1 N2 equal we are having N1 N2 over A beta squared plus beta alpha squared minus 2H alpha beta that this ratio is K say it is K with help of this look here we are having this from this we are getting this ratio now now if these two generators be right angles then we can say l1 l2 plus m1 m2 plus n1 n2 equal to 0 we know this condition if two generators are equal then product and sum of the alternative direction cosines becomes 0 that is l1 and l2 plus m1 m2 plus n1 n2 equal to 0 then from and hence we can say and hence we can say a plus b plus c equal to 0 so is the condition Record condition for two generators are perpendicular. That means two generators are right angles. Therefore, two generators are right angles. And hence, another two generators are right angle, then another two writers are to generate a angle. Therefore, from that symmetry, you can see cone has infinite number of sets of three mutually perpendicular generators. Therefore, perpendicular generators, condition for perpendicular generators is A plus B plus C equal zero, where A, B, C is the coefficient of uh, X square, Y square and Z square. That means look at here, therefore the condition, we can talk about this condition have, that is A plus B plus C equal 0 is the condition for that the core have mutually perpendicular generators. We have done, please subscribe our YouTube channel.